Happy anniversary, everyone! So we're, uh, we're actually at the park right now. Um, we've talked about, uh, about some of the differences in, in the Filipino with the Filipino culture. And one of the things is that we've been going to, to uh, a Filipino church. So it's all Filipino people. Uh, it was on our very, one of our first videos we talked about it. Uh, Point of Grace Church. Um, it's a part of a, a, larger, a larger network uh, of churches. We are part of this big family of Converge. Uh, extending all the way to all the countries in the south, um, that uh, that reaches all over the all over the world. Um, yeah. There's there's uh, they've got churches that are part of this network in uh, in Haiti and in the Dominican Republic and, and and all over. Converge is a family of churches, and so we have about 1,700 plus churches now in our movement in the United States. The southeast has the Caribbean. Okay, which is the only district that has the Caribbean. And Converge Embassy, that's us, okay? So we have um, almost 700 churches in our district. So today is uh, Point of Grace Church's uh, 29th anniversary. Yes. So it's, been, it's been, uh, been 29 years. Our pastor, Pastor Norbert, has been a pastor here for three yes. years. So he's, he took over for the previous pastor. Yes. Um, right now... They, they used to have a, their own location. They used to have like a church, an actual building, but they no longer have a building. So right now they do all of their sermons actually in a movie theater. So that's where we, uh, where we did a movie theater. Uh, so we're coming here today um, for a special, we're at the park. It's a special celebration. This park here. Right. It's a, this, is the park in the uh, this is C.B. Smith Park. Uh, you, you can see it here. C.B. Smith Park. So it's a beautiful park. Yes. So we're here yes. for their uh, 29th uh, anniversary. Uh, we're going to be doing the sermon. Everything is going to be here at the park. We're going to be doing the sermon at the park. Uh, after the sermon, we're going to have some great Filipino food, which I'll show you. We'll show you. Um, <laughs> Tell to them, what's your favorite? What's your favorite? <laughs> My favorite. Now, so, so far. <laughs> so, so far, there, I mean, I have, I have lots of favorites. I have to say, they're, they're, they're so... I mean, and, and my beautiful, my beautiful wife, she's such, such a great cook mm -hmm. uh, of all these things like pancit and, <laughs> and adobo chicken and, and all these things. Uh, but there's a, there's, I don't know what the name, what was the name of that soup that I had today? That it's arascaldo. Arascaldo. Yeah. Arascaldo. It's kind of like a chicken, so it's, it's yeah, a lot like a chicken soup, but it's like thick. It's like has a, has a, has a yeah. thickness to it, almost like a chowder, right? So it's kind of like a chowder mm -hmm. with this chicken and then big chunk, like they put big chunks of chicken in it, but it uses, uh, what do you call it? Sticky rice. Yeah. So it has sticky rice in there, and that sticky rice um, gives it that that thicker, thicker texture to it. Yeah. Kind of like uh, there's another biko. Yeah. Biko is a is like a dessert that they use that same mm -hmm. sticky rice. Uh, it's called biko, and it's got again has that that thicker, like almost like a tapioca. It reminds me a lot of tapioca. It has that like tapioca um, texture to it yeah. and thickness and feel, but with the little pieces, yeah. you get the little pieces of tapioca. So same thing with the with this with the little pieces of like the rice. So I took guys, this is all Filipino food. We've got a little bit of pan sit, got lechon, rice. And here with the desserts. All yummy stuff. Uh, we're here. We're going to be going to this uh, to this anniversary celebration, which is going to be uh, it's going to be nice. Uh, it's a beautiful day outside, as you can see here. Take yeah, a look. look at that. There's an event. Beautiful, so beautiful day out, as you can see. See how nice it is out here. So it's beautiful. Dear God, it's beautiful. Well, there's a birthday party. Uh, yeah, a lot of people come here, the uh, C.B. Smith Park. Because this is a nice place too when you uh, celebrate birthday party. It's somebody's birthday today! Or, uh, what are the events? 
Republic. An anniversaries, Bad birthday person, parties. Baptist. I think they do. I think they do uh, weddings here too. I've seen people get uh, get married here. Yeah. So we're gonna be it's meeting a, up. It's a gym, right? It's it's. Uh, I, I don't know how much it costs to rent the pavilion, but you can you can you can check with the CB Smith Park. It's a part of Broward Parks. Mm -hmm. It's a part of the Broward, Broward uh, County uh, Park System. So if you're interested in doing something like that. Uh, but I'd also uh, suggest you checking out Point of Grace Church, and I'll put the link in the description. But they are on Facebook, so you can see them on Facebook. Um, if you don't, if you're not in the area, you just want to see them online. You know, check them out online. <clears throat> um, it's uh, again Point of Grace uh, International Church. It's a small church with a big heart. We are a small church with a big heart. Check them out. People, nice people. Absolutely. And again, it's like a family here. Right. And, and that's, remember, that's something that I've noticed a lot in the Filipino culture is that, that aspect of familiness, that, that just, you feel welcomed when you, when, when, when you're around. You don't feel that you're kind of, kind of out of place. You don't feel, that that you're that you an are. outcast you, yes. you, they, they immediately make you feel like you're a part of this family this this small family ohana means family that seems to be a fairly consistent thing in the filipino culture is that they're very open to people they're very friendly um, they're always willing to to lend a hand and help it just seems that that's that's just a part of of their culture which is which is amazing uh, and one of the things that I love about the culture and about my wife, that welcoming, warming thing. So we're going to head in there. We're going to uh, go in, meet up with the, all the parishioners, uh, go inside, uh, start the sermon. Come along. Come join us. Yeah. Come on, guys. So I throw up my hands and praise you again and again. You saw that I have is a heart. Our speaker today is Ernie Cabrera. Pastor Ernie is the Executive Minister of uh, Southeast Converged. Just a friendly reminder, if you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. We'd also love to hear from you, so leave a comment. Also, if you'd like to be notified when we post videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you get those notifications. From all of us in the Hollow Hollow family, thanks for joining us on this journey that we're embarking on.